Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Food by Ifia. So today we are going to make a very simple and delicious meal called Gary Pino. These are the ingredients you will need and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Okay guys, so first we are going to put our chicken in the oven. This is already steamed, yeah. So I'm going to add a bit of the green paste that I blended. And then I'm going to add this Nandu spice, yes. You can get this in any other hyper supermarket. So this will be going straight into the oven now. And then we can proceed with our stew. Okay, so just make sure that you mix it very well. Make sure that all the spice gets into it. Okay, my oven is already heated. Preheat your oven before you put any other chicken or any other thing in it. Yeah, so this will be going straight into my oven. And then we're going to be starting with our stew. Okay, so I use the same pan for I use the same pan which I use for the steaming of the chicken. I'm going to throw in my onion and then the paste. Add my tomato paste. Give it a nice stir. And then now I'm adding my blended tomatoes, onion and ginger. I'm going to leave this to simmer for about um, five to 10 minutes and then we get it done. Okay guys, so as you can see, my stew is almost ready. I'm just adding my cube and then the rest of the vegetables. I give it a nice stir. I'm adding my stock. This is the stock I got from the chicken. So this will be like the base for the pinot, yes. So I'll be adding hot water to it, yes. And then I'll leave it to boil for some time and then I'm going to add the gari. I'm adding just a teaspoon of salt, sorry, a tablespoon of salt. Give it a nice taste. So this is actually going to be on a high heat, yeah. So I just added curry to it and then I'll be adding a bit of water. So when you're adding the water, just be careful because when you add it too much and then your gari or your cassava flakes is not much, it's going to be very, very soft. Okay, so as you can see, I'll be adding my gari bit by bit. Keep stirring, keep stirring. So when you notice that you need a little bit more water, you can still add it. So I'll keep stir, and then I'm going to add, actually scooped out of the stew, some out. So I'm going to add it bit by bit to it to make sure that my gari pino is very soft. Keep stirring. So be folding it in and out gently, in and out gently. 
it's actually very easy to make okay guys okay so our gari pino is done our chicken is nicely grilled i'm going to be scooping the, I'll, I'll be molding this actually in a very nice plate and then i will just try it and then give me a feedback later thank you thank you all for watching hey please don't don't forget to subscribe and i'll be coming your way very very soon with other simple and delicious meals bye